Um, my ex, yung kinikwento ko, she's not my first relationship, but she was my first love. And I was able to say that kasi it was a relationship na pinaglaban ko talaga hanggang dulo. The first time I fell in love was in fourth grade. Grade 7 ako. First year in college. I think I was around 18-ish. Ang bata ko pa nun na. <laughs> it was kind of like a movie scenario in a, alam mo yung sa balcony ako, and I saw this girl walking across the aisle. Tapos parang, uy, ganda nun. <laughs> there was this transfer student. As soon as she transferred, she was already an honor student. And then, come sixth grade graduation, surprise, ako pala yung valedictorian. And siya yung salutatorian. We were sort of rivals. Hanggang ngayon, magkakilala pa rin kami. I liked her continuously. A classic ko siya nung ano yung grade 7, tapos parang ano lang, parang nagbibigay siya ng motibo ganun. Pero straight talaga siya. Oh, um, may mata sa gig. I'm a very extroverted person kasi I like making friends. I went near her. Sabi ko, "Hi, like ganun, I'm Julia." So we sat down and then we started talking. I just felt the connection from there. Actually, ako lang yung may gusto sa kanya ng 10th grade. And then at the end of that school year, I got fast ako sa kanya. Then he rejected me and he said that he didn't want to reciprocate my feelings just simply because he didn't like me that time. Then I went to him and I asked my teacher, "No, and na parang sa ang class yun." Then yun. Sino ko na I found out her name. Then I added her on Yahoo Messenger. Yahoo Messenger pa nene. Then after that, then she just chatted with me one day. She said, "Not yet, but later. That you were the one who sent me on Twitter. She said, 'You are hidden, but that's it.'" But that's it. Then she was with me for four months. I'm a very rational person. So I'm logical. Kung tao eh. And for some reason, when it's a matter of love or something, nagiging irrational ako. Parang nagpapabibo ako ganun. Every time na halimbawa, recitation ganun. Lagi ako nag-recite. Tapos every time na after ko mag-recite, tumitingin agad ako kung ano yung facial expression na. 2019, nagkita ulit kami by surprise. Tinatawag ako ng office mo, Uy, Kevin! 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 And then, nung lumingon ako, nandun siya. Nalaman ko na she works nearby. And I was... Asking her out from time to time. Umuo ako naman siya. Kung hindi nagkaroon ng quarantine, maliligaw sana ako. Sadly, or unfortunately, she got married all of a sudden. The guy she married, parang bigla na lang sumulpot during quarantine. Akala ko, ang tingin ko sa kanya ng answered prayer. So sabi ko, gagawin ko lahat pa hindi kami mag-break kasi ang tagal kong hiningi ito eh. Uh, mas nag-focus ako sa relationship namin. In a way, at some point, it was... Where my world was revolving around, which was not good. I tend to just follow what he wants. Laging siya na yung kasama ko, yung friends ko na kakalimutan ko na na nagkaroon na ng time na nagtatalo na kami ng friends. So hindi ko naman siya sabi nagpretend ako the whole time na kami. Pero hindi ako naging ako. Natakot ako na bakak hindi niya ako matanggap as much as I did to him. Pero hindi nang kami nagtagal. So we lasted two years. Didn't turn out to be anything. She was there during my best and my worst moments. And yeah, first, first love life, first heartache, and all. Kapag in love ka, sometimes it makes you do things. Kahit minsan labag na sa principio mo as a person. Di ko rin alam if paano ko na sabi in love. Kasi yung thinking kasi ng bata is kung sino yung first mo yun ay last. Parang lahat ka ka inimo para lang to end up with him or her at the end of the day. Kasi minahal mo naman yon tao dahil hindi sa kung anong natatamasa niya sa buhay, hindi dahil sa kung ano itsura niya. Kasi tanggap mo, mahal mo. Unconditional. It's not a feeling lang eh. It's not something that you feel eh. You have to choose kasi it takes effort. Um, my ex, yung kinikwento ko, she's not my first relationship, but she was my first love. And I was able to say that kasi it was a relationship na pinaglaban ko talaga hanggang dulo. So, I tried my best to fight for our love kahit na ayaw ng parents ko. That's why any kind of relationship, masaya siya sa start, you know, the butter Butterflies, hardcore feelings, and everything. But after a while, because it becomes something that you maintain, and it's hard to maintain things. And I think, you know, love is a choice. It's not just a feeling. So choosing this person, it really made me say, I was in love with you. Love is choosing to maintain that because it's more worth it to keep rather than let go. Hindi lang pala puro kilig, hindi lang pala puro saya kapag nagmamahal ka. Kailangan mo rin masakta na ilang beses para matuto. Sometimes holding on is not the best answer to prove that you really love the person. Kasi sometimes holding too much will really break you. We had a lot of fights, petty to big fights. And I later on realized in therapy that it wasn't love anymore towards the end. And it was more of like my attachment issues and even if I love this this person so much, it won't guarantee that she would do the same for me. And that's what happened. 
kailangan din realistic ka mag-isip. To prevent further damage sa partner mo, you have to sacrifice things and kahit gaano siya ka-painful, if nakikita niyo na hindi naman na talaga mag-work for the long run, then you have to stop. Syempre, it's easier said than done. If I could say something to my younger self, you will never be too much for the right person. And if hindi ka totoo or you don't feel at home with the person that you're with, it's not love. Be smart, eh. <laughs> be wise. Eh. I set the bar very low for what being smart is. Just don't put yourself in dangerous situations. Wag magabol. Pag feeling mong wala namang interest sa yo, de ba? Wag mo nang pagdikdikan yung sarili. Even though there are so many regrets on my younger self way back then, she did a great choice sa mga nangyari sa life niya. Cringe siya, pero they were all kind of necessary to kind of slap me in the face na ba't ba't mo ginagawa sa sarili mo to? The reason why I made so many bad decisions before is because I realized that I didn't love myself. Na I was looking for that validation, acceptance, and love from another person when it should have come from me all along. Magmahal ka lang nagmamahal, pero wag mo ibibigay lahat. Make sure na meron kang titira sa sarili mo. Don't lose that sense of individuality and always focus on yourself while loving that person. Kasi pag naubos ka na, wala ka na magagawa. Hanggang sa mga susunod na taong makikilala mo. The advice I usually give people who are just starting out, you really have to go around, you really have to meet people. You, that's the only way you will know what you like and dislike. I think uh, people have to disregard things like timing or being it too early or too late. Do not try to define when it is right, when it is wrong. If you don't try and you just get everything from media, get everything from movie series, so unrealistic na expectations of love. Kasi you'll suddenly realize you lost the chance. There's that whole disillusionment that you have to go through and it's a tough process and a lot of people don't, don't get past that point. You didn't even have the chance to take the shot. Hey guys. Yes. So we hope you like that video. So as you know, we've been creating content for you guys for the past year. But we've only been doing it part-time. Nandito po kami, kumakatok po kami sa mga puso nyo. So we are launching a membership program where if you want to support us more, you can contribute to the channel so we can grow the team, produce more shows, and for you guys to get to know us better. Kapag sumali kayo dun sa membership program, meron kayong exclusive channel perks and privileges like custom YouTube stickers, exclusive monthly live streams with us, and exclusive behind-the-scenes vlogs. Check out the join video found in our page to find out. Join video? Check out the join, join, the join button, button found in our page to find, find out, out more information. Yun na yun! Yun na yun! <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!